The Pequot Lakes softball team has qualified for the Class 2A state tournament. They earned their trip after rallying past Pierce 7-5 and will return to the tournament for the first time since 2013. Our Chelsea Brown has more. It doesn't even feel real. When we won last Thursday against Piers, I didn't even think it was real. Um, <laughs> because I've never experienced it. Only Barbara Miller and Haley Weeble can remember the last time the Pequot Lakes softball team competed in the state tournament. It feels good to be back. Um, definitely different. I mean, freshman year I was really nervous, but this year I'm just ready to take it head on and do our best. Having experience at state definitely gives you a one-up on other opponents who haven't had quite that experience. Six seniors currently fill the infield and have contributed to the last five years of success with the program having 102 wins and 18 losses. When you have success and you have seniors who buy in, things go well for you. And this group bought in, and I mean, they've, they've been together since T-ball. The team this year has already broken a school record of 23 wins in a season. And on the mound, Catherine Miska has broke her strikeout record, telling 288, and has been a major contributor to this team. It really does, because it's like my last run at it, you know, and it's just like I did it. We had a strong season and we had a strong pitcher, so um, being ap able to actually get the work done uh, has felt really good because it shows that we know that we had the talent, but it shows that we actually do have the talent. Records aside, Coach believes they have the essentials to perform well at the state level. We've got the seniors, we've got the pitching, our fielding has really come on, our bats are starting to wake up a little bit. Um, I think we can make some noise down there. Their new goal is just to win a game down at the tournament. In Pequot Lakes, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.